Running errands can be difficult when you have ADHD, but um, you know, we, we persevere and we make it through and, and we do what we do. So we'll be alright. I've been feeling less and I think I need to be found. I ain't been in shock. So I walk in the spot soon. I recorded a video this morning to start my vlog off, thinking that the audio was on, and it wasn't. So thank you, because you taught me something, and now I know to, you know, have my uh, my, my ducks in a row. So uh, we're headed to the barber shop right now. It says we'll get there at 10.06. So that means that we're gonna be six minutes late for our appointment. And as a result, I'm gonna have to pay him six extra dollars. That was my rule. Um, so more than likely, that's probably gonna happen. That's fine, but uh, you know, this is gonna be the event that gets the day started. And once I, uh, I got to sneeze. Once I get my hair cut, I come back and my hair's looking good and. I'm awake because I was at the barber shop. Now I'd be in the best possible position to uh, finish the rest of the errands. I gotta drop off Zoe at the dog sitter. So I gotta drop off Zoe. That's my dog, by the way, for those of y'all who don't know. At Vanessa's place. Shout out to Vanessa. And then after that, uh, I got some sketch comedy. Uh, Skits I'm working on with uh, KLTV, DeAndre. I think that's on the schedule. And um, of course, got the Facebook live show tonight. I'm Dr. Uma talking about food and mental health. <laughs> mental health. Uh, gotta wake up. And um, of course, I have to make my own, you know, videos. I put out a couple of TikToks and IG and Facebook reels today. Um, so yeah, it's a, it's a pretty packed day. I got a lot to get done before tomorrow. Tomorrow we head to Austin, Texas for South by Southwest. So yeah, it's a pretty busy Wednesday and um, kind of off to like a, a shaky start, but we're gonna right the ship uh, very shortly. So then you get to the barbershop in like, let's see, like six minutes from now. Okay. Got a small penalty to pay, but it's still gonna be a pretty good day. Yo, what's good, my boy? It's good to see you, bro. I like the new spot. Yeah, it's chill, bro. We got the haircuts uh, from my laptop. I have to get some work done. Every second counts. So, I'm about to head back to the crib. I uh, have to drop off though with the dog sitter. I see what's going on. Is that my is that my backup phone? Yeah, can I get it? I appreciate it. I forgot it. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, I forgot it. Thank you though. I right, love you. Take care. See, I forgot my backup phone. Mickey Ficky Zo, come on. Zo, Zo. So Zo is happy because we're about to go run errands and I oh lick me in the mouth. Uh because I'm going to Austin tomorrow, she gets to go see the, the dog sitter for a couple of days. Ain't that right, Zoe? So it's about to be Vanessa time. Zoe loves Vanessa maybe more than she loves me. So uh, I'm gonna drop the dog off and then mail a couple of things uh, before traffic gets too you know, crazy in LA and then get back home and then uh, get back to the next thing. So running errands can be difficult when you have ADHD, but um, you know, we, we persevere and we make it through and, and we do what we do, so. We'll be all right. Good girl. When she sees Vanessa, she's gonna flip out. Oh, so relax, baby. Relax. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Zo, leave her alone. Ah, Zo, sit. Hey, Zo. I think she's gonna pee on the floor. Oh, she peed, right? She peed, right? Yeah. Oh, Mickey Ficky. Good zo, good zo. I appreciate you. All right, so we pulled up here. It's time to go grab my, um, grab some mail. And uh, if you all gonna ask me if I wear my scrubs everywhere, uh, the answer to that is yes. 
um but i do have other clothes like i i, I wear more than just scrubs but you know i'm always filming you know my my ig and facebook and tiktok and youtube videos um you know so i'm always in the scrubs so uh, but i do have other clothes just to put that out there um but yeah i'm gonna go pick up some mail and i actually have to ship out four copies of my book um to kendra she was a guest on the facebook live show she was a guest on the late night show with dr kojo not too long ago um you know we talked a little bit about polyamory and mental health so i'm gonna ship off you know some books to her household right here it's hard to hold up four books but you get the point you already won a journey through education nursing and mental health awareness this book really kind of uh you know started my whole online type of career you know like it gave me the confidence to start talking about what i wanted to talk about on the internet so you know shout out to this book uh, it did change my life, so I'm very grateful for it. So I'm going to send off these copies, and then I'm going to scoop up my mail and then head back home. And I have a meeting with my uh, publicist at um, actually like in 10, 15 minutes. So uh, i got to get to that. Um, but yeah, it's been a good day so far. Um, I started off rough, right? I started off rough. Couldn't get out of bed, but now we're we're making progress, so we're gonna, you know, we're gonna end the day on the right note. But um, the day's not over yet, and we have so much more to do. So we gotta gotta keep it pushing, right? Push and pee. All right, so we are at the end of the day. I am preparing to go work out. So I'm getting my pre-workout together and uh, mix it up a little bit. I have to review. Uh, it's funny, I'm. You know, recording the back end of this vlog now. I gotta look over uh, some other uh, video content right before I hit the gym. Uh, and after that, I'm gonna. I guess this vlog. I guess this. Hmm. I guess we cannot end this vlog here because I gotta go. Uh, I gotta go to uh, a comedy show tonight after the gym. So <laughs> this is quite the. This is quite the day, but. Um, it has been a productive day and you know we started this day off rough so um i'm proud of i'm proud of where, where we're at but this this is pretty much what like my days look like you know you might have a rough start some days but we always bounce back we always make it you know we make it good so all right so i ran out of time so i actually was not able to go to the gym i did a little home workout in the garage i got uh, a lot of jumping jacks in so that was good and now it's time to head out to this show uh and see what uh the show is up to so we just pulled up to the chateau. The comedy chateau. No ho. The mask mandate in California is uplifted, correct? Right? I think it's over. They said in two weeks you don't have to fly with your mask on anymore. Hey. Good. You got tickets? Yes, sir. Oh, great. Who are you here to see? Uh, Jay. Hey. hey. We're live at the Comedy Chateau. Right? Thursday yeah. Wednesday night. Good, That's man. good, boss. Yes, sir. It's good to see you back. I'm doing good. How about you? Yes, sir. Good, yes, sir. Right. I'm happy I'm not late. The best thing. You know, I'm at listen to that shit. Bro. I need your Instagram, too, man. You know I got what I'm saying? You. I got you. We can, we can do it now. Let's get it. Let's get it right now. Yeah. Hey, he put me on my first comedy show. We got to keep yeah. him on this. It's going to be funny. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. It's okay. I think we're here. Uh-huh. And they saw me like almost sleeping up in front of hey, the Yeah. Morning. Really? They made a joke. Yeah, if you go to the, the, the comedy show at the front, sometimes a comedians would like use you for crowd work. And maybe they'll roast sometimes show you a little bit. Yeah. Sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. Yeah, I, I don't mind because like, you know. It's all funny games. Yeah. Not much you can say that's going to. You, you can say something bad though. Yeah. Yeah, you can. I'm not tripping for real. <laughs> I remember once the one comedy show told where there was that guy in, in the crowd and he was funnier than the dude on the stage. Yeah, I, I, I might know what you're talking about. Alright, y'all good? What y'all doing? Y'all feeling okay? Don't be depressed yet. The full training started yet. Damn. How y'all feeling, man? Give it up for yourself for showing up. Woo! Hold on, we, hold on, y'all. We gonna start all over again in two minutes. Let me go check the mic. <laughs> Alright, and I need y'all to get ghetto with me, alright? This is not a regular 
poetry event, okay? We could clap, snap, we could tell a bitch to run that shit back, we stomping, all that shit, all right? Woo. All right. And if ever you feel I am detached, you will always be able to find me in my notebook. Thank you. Woo. All right, so that's gonna, that's gonna be it, you know? That, that's gonna wrap up uh, quite a busy day. L like y'all saw, the day started off kind of rough. Make sure the camera is back on me correctly. The day started off kind of rough, woke up late, and uh, yeah, started off rough, but we turned it around, I'd like to say, and we, we had a pretty productive day today, so I'm proud of the day that I had, and got to work out, got to run some errands, got to prepare for um, this big day I have tomorrow. So it was a pretty productive day, and I, I have to say that I'm proud of myself. And yeah, I just gotta keep it pushing. I'm about to call my mom now because she texted me. So definitely wanna call my mom and make sure I do that. Uh, and after that, go up and just put the finishing touches to the packing uh, and prepare for South by Southwest. Um, it'll be my first time in Austin, Texas. So I'm looking forward to that. And uh, once again, you know, I'm grateful to sh be able to share my life, uh, you know, on this level with you all. So I'm not gonna keep you all for too long. But if you made this far in the video, I do appreciate your attention. Uh, and until next time, peace. I've been feeling less and I think I need to be found I ain't been in shock So I walk in the spot soon